The SeaTac Flow VPX system provides accurate process control and monitoring in real time with minimal cleaning and maintenance. Today, we will be covering how to clean and maintain your Flow VPX system after each run, to prepare it for the next run, and to keep the system performing at proper transmission level. To maintain your system's health, we recommend running a quick check before each run, running a coupler check weekly, and a system suitability test monthly. Frequency of the test may vary for different lab environments. After you've completed the process run and flushed your solution, we recommend running 0.5 molar of sodium hydroxide through the skid, Flow VPX, and same flow cell for a total of 30 minutes. Then flush with water and leave the system and flow cell dry. If you're planning on performing another run with the same flow cell, initiate the manual transmission check. To perform the manual transmission check, navigate to Quick Kinetics within the software. Click Quick Check on the instrument control to start the quick check process. The software will quickly begin measuring transmission and will display the results. If the results fail, refer to our troubleshooting video for suggestions of resolving low transmission. If you are changing or disposing the current flow cell, begin the unloading procedure. For more complete instructions, consult the hardware manual or watch our video about loading and unloading the flow cell. Once the flow cell is unloaded, Viper will automatically run a transmission check the next time you load a new flow cell. You are now ready for your next run. For any questions, please contact our application specialist at the following contact information.